on Venus, which is where they're going to send these little um, remote control balloons, there it's completely acid. You know, it's like <laughs> raining acid on it. And the temperature difference between night and day is in hundreds and hundreds of degrees. It's this little company, it's maybe 150 people, but it's based out in the middle of Oregon countryside, right out by the coast where really cows and cheese are what it's all about. This little company is working with NASA, the Jet Propulsion Laboratory, European Space Agency. Well, their bread and butter are really big balloons. As it goes up to 23 miles above the ground, it expands and it goes to like 99.99% of the atmosphere, which is a bit like the atmosphere of Mars. And they can bring it a bit lower to try and get it to a different planet's atmospheres. So that's why they take it up there. And then they're like, they have a payload. If you look up, it's absolutely clear, empty space. There's no main flight lines through there or, 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 or military bases. And if you're picking up really massive pieces of machinery, taking them up 23 miles up high and dropping them to test the parachute, which may or may not work, you want to do that in a sparsely populated area where there aren't a lot of other planes or drones or God knows what else going on. They have been making uh, balloons that keep the Orion spacecraft floating upright when it lands in the water. But the most interesting one for me is they're making remote control balloons. What can float for days, weeks, months, longer even. If it's remote control, you go a little higher and the weather is blowing one direction. Go a little lower, the weather's blowing in another direction. So you can actually steer it. So they've got to figure out how to float this thing in, in an acid bath that's between, you know, minus God knows how many degrees centigrade and a hundred, you know, how hot it gets. But it's yeah. a it's a big test that they're trying to figure out right now.